Well, what I have to say is that Great Hearts Online has been an awesome experience for me, and I hope that you love it. There's lots that you can learn. Literature, science, the arts, so many different clubs and ways that we interact. When we tried Great Hearts Online, we just absolutely loved it. That it's just an amazing means in school. There's nothing really bad about it. We value relationships over everything. And in our online community, at our online school, that is something we take great pride in and that we work at each and every day. My children actually look forward to their class time. With, um, they, they haven't met many of these kids in person, but they have developed a relationship even online with the teacher. Compared to uh, brick and mortar classes, I feel like we get to have access to teachers all over. Because we have a, a younger child, as well as Jaden, we don't really have the time to be like full hands on with him. So I'm just really surprised at his independence and the way he's just been able to navigate Canvas and Great Hearts Online. So a little bit about our curriculum. I delight in our curriculum, and I would say that in both the brick and mortar school and in our online school. And one of the things that I was most concerned about is, can we do this thing in an online environment that we've been doing in our brick and mortar schools. And I will tell you that we've worked very, very hard and I am excited about what we're seeing. Being able to still engage in Socratic discussion, still go deep into math and understand the why, to, to explore history and to not only look at it from every class, you know, you, you have this lecture that goes in and this discussion, but then to challenge them to go and find something that they are empowered by in the story of history as they move forward. Every student is engaged in both English and in another language, whether that's in the lower schools in Spanish or the upper schools in Latin, because we know that that acquiring of language is really important at a younger age. And then of course, we believe that every, every scholar, every person has the capacity to not only be an artist, but a musician and to engage in those works of art and to look for things that are truly beautiful and to things that we can find truth in science and in math. But my favorite thing about in selecting great hearts was, was the virtues, was the um, curriculum, was the classical approach. And um, I, as an educator myself, I love that they'll get the whole picture. At the core of all our decisions are our learning goals for our students. We, we often look at a lesson and ask ourselves, what do we want a child to be able to know, love, or do at the end of this process? And with that in mind, we can then think about what's the correct approach. But there's this broad, these two buckets of the live learning, what's happening synchronously with the teacher over a Zoom session like this, and then what's happening independently, working in our learning management system. So there's a variety of tools we use, there's a variety of approaches, but at the heart of it is, is always thinking, what is gonna be a rich experience? What's gonna be a deep thinking experience? Um, and then of course, drawing connections between a, the different elements of our curriculum, right? What, how can we have art in science? How can we connect history to ELA? And I think that's one of the real strengths as well, is we're connecting the real and the digital as well as connecting different subjects. Great Hearts Online is a wonderful choice for your family for a variety of reasons. I think the biggest reason is, is the flexibility of getting a wonderful classical liberal arts education no matter where you are. This is a journey that we are going on together. We are building culture and community with parents. We're building culture and community with scholars. And over time, we'll build connections across state lines for our kids. It is an amazing gift um, that we are able to offer Great Hearts Online as a public charter school in Texas and in Arizona in the coming year. The thing that surprised me most about Great Hearts Online is how Great Hearts gets such good teachers because usually when you go to a school, you would always have that one mean teacher, but at this school, there just is none. Like they're just all so happy and nice and welcoming to the class. I see often my other students in the chat saying, great job, Grace, or that was really good, Briella. And it's really sweet to see that they're they're feeling like they're a friend. But we really make the greatest effort to take 
as much out of every minute that we have with the kiddos as we can. We have a variety of, of, of students with a variety of needs. And, you know, I'm so thankful that we can service, service, them, uh, service them all. So be open to it is what I would say.